looking at gusts as high as 50 miles per hour through the Los Angeles and Ventura County mountains. And indeed, we could see 80s returning to the forecast. I'll tell you when, but first, let's show you what's, what it's like at LAX. Tonight, we are expecting that fog to return. We're looking at uh, more of an onshore flow in our forecast for the next few days. So those 60s are going to hang around. We will be below the averages for the next few days. Sky Tracker indicating where we are tonight. Lots of cloud cover out there at 56 in the downtown area, 57 at Long Beach, 54 at Riverside. And let's show you that wind advisory that is in effect for the LA and Ventura County Mountains through tomorrow morning, 9 a.m. Uh, the I-5 corridor could have the strongest winds, winds 25 to 35 miles per hour, but gusts as high as 50 miles per hour. Average high today should be around 72 degrees. We were below those averages, as you can see, 70 at Woodland Hills, only 62 at LAX, 66 downtown at USC, as well as Burbank, 63, Redondo Beach, and Ontario, and Anaheim about 65. All right, well, we are watching, uh, as I said, a little bit of an onshore push, and with that, cloud cover and fog, early tomorrow morning should be burning off probably around 10 30 or 11 in most areas giving way to mostly sunny skies but that daytime heating really isn't going to happen until probably Thursday we'll have 70s back in the forecast by then and maybe even some 80s through our uh, valleys and through the Inland Empire in the meantime low pressure winding up causing a lot of problems across the northern tier of the country they're still looking at more snow in Minnesota rain trailing from that into uh, portions of the upper Great Lakes in Wisconsin and heavy showers and strong thunderstorms over the southern tip of Florida. Look what else is going on through the Rockies. They're getting rain and in the higher elevations a little freezing rain indicated there over the western slope of Colorado. Our forecast tomorrow if you're heading out of the water, well we'll have that early morning fog. Air temperature 59 to 66 degrees at the beach. Water temp 53 to 60 and surf height 2 to 4 feet. Tonight, patchy fog, increasing clouds are low dropping to about 53 degrees. And then for your Monday, we're going to warm things up just a few degrees from where we were today. We're looking at uh, high in the uh, upper 60s generally, mostly sunny skies by late afternoon. But again, morning fog, 67 will be our daytime high. Sunrise tomorrow, 632, sunset tomorrow night at 719. Here's your five days. Some cooler than normal temperatures, a little morning fog to start with. This is how our forecast is going to be for the next four days. Then expect a big warm up. Outside right now, we do have some fog in the area. There's Santa Monica cam showing you a little bit of cloud cover and those foggy conditions continuing right now. Partly cloudy skies a little further inland, 56 at Long Beach, 55 downtown and 51 degrees at Riverside. We have a high wind advisory to tell you about, so let's switch sources here and show you that high wind advisory. Uh, for the LA and Ventura County mountains, the I-5 corridor will have the strongest winds and we're looking at gusts as high as 50 miles per hour and sustained 25 to 35 through early tomorrow morning. Today's highs across the region average should be about 72. We were below the averages across the board. 65 at Thousand Oaks, 63 Ontario and Redondo Beach, 66 Burbank and into US see again tomorrow maybe a degree or so warmer but not much we've had this onshore push we'll continue with that that'll mean fog in the morning through about Wednesday and those cooler than normal temperatures by Thursday we begin to warm things up snow across the northern tier of the US for areas of Minnesota below that a lot of rain heading into the Great Lakes region and also rain and freezing rain throughout the uh, Rockies storms severe across southern sections of Florida. Tomorrow out on the water, here's what you can expect. Early morning fog, air temperature 59 to 60, water temperature 53 to 60 degrees, and surf height 2.